Today we're interviewing some skateboarders around school to find out what skateboarding means to them. Everybody knows that the dice are loaded. Everybody rolls. It's fun and creative. You can just do whatever you want when there's no rules. It really is my favorite hobby, and I wouldn't say it's much of a hobby. It's become more of a lifestyle because ever since I've started, everything I've looked at, everything I think about, I just kind of think of ways I can implement it into skateboarding. So like if I'm in the car and I see like a stair set or a ledge, I think of different tricks I could do on that. It's just changed the way I look at the world. Uh, I think because most of my friends do it, my families do it, my brothers skate. And so it's pretty jazzy. Uh, it really started with the cartoon 16. I saw the one character Jude skateboarding in the mall, and I was like, that's totally gonna be my thing. I'm into it. Tony Hawk Pro Skater. My brothers and his friends. Like, seriously, his friends became my friends through skateboarding. Everybody knows. I started skateboarding when I was eight, so nine years. Uh, I've been skateboarding since I was like six or seven. I don't, I don't know. Most of my life, really. Seriously, just a few years, but since I was around six. Everybody knows you've been discreet. I don't know. The skateboard, there's so many tricks. I think my favorite has to be the 360 flip, which I can't do yet, unfortunately, because it sucks, but. Favorite trick would probably be a uh, 360 kick flip. Probably the 360 flip. That's how it goes. I have Rails, Rails, Rails by Evan Goodfellow, who I do not know, but probably if you looked up his bio, he's likely broken both wrists multiple times. I'm not saying he doesn't know what he's talking about, I'm just saying maybe not for me. Um, dropping in with Andy Mack, the life of a pro skateboarder. Again, probably lots of broken bones. Is this, is this, like, is this a coincidence? I don't know. And then skateboarding to the extreme will probably tell you to not skateboard in the halls at school. And extreme skateboarding, which is probably very much the same as this one. I don't know. How extreme can you get? Dropping out of a helicopter. You have to read it. 796.22, come see me if you want to. Don't skateboard in this one. People like me are going to fall down. Because you're going to relate to this. I'm not talking about your skill. You might have excellent skills. But you don't get to knock other people down. I'm not going to talk. Just go, just go around. Outside of the school, if you're on the sidewalk, again, I'm going to go, be careful. Really knock elderly people down. Just watch what you're doing. Um. I have no issue with skateboarding. So, as you can see, skateboarding is a passionate hobby for some people and not so much for others. What everybody knows.